Then food diligence alpha mix Paula's prayer and hereditary rule. The leader is Tom Eric away from the final flight in the boil four-year-old maiden hurdle. It's Tom Eric stretching on from Arthur Fonzarelli who's drifted over to the rail on the stand side. But it is Tom Eric and uh, Connor McNamara for He's dead, Eric. Arthur Fonzarelli second. Then Food Diligence Alpha Mix. Hereditary rule follows them home. Then Food Diligence Alpha Mix. Paula's prayer and hereditary rule. The leader is Tom Eric away from the final flight. In the boil four-year-old maiden hurdle, it's Tom Eric stretching on from Arthur Fonzarelli, who's drifted over to the rail on the stand side. But it is Tom Eric and uh, Connor McNamara for... He's dead, Eric. Arthur Fonzarelli second. And for diligence, Alpha Mix, hereditary rule follows them home. And then Broomfield's Oscar Bay Ambition and Tokyo Getaway as they come down to the final flight. Lil Smith with Wealth set up on the near side challenging and it's Wealth set up on the near side getting level with Lil Smith there out in front of Bay Ambition and racing inside the last 150 yards. It's Wealth set up and Ricky Doyle stretching on as they run to the finish markedly down in grade and distance justifies odds on favoritism by a couple of lengths. Wealth set up beat Lil Smith, Bay Ambition and Broomfield's Oscar. And then Broomfield's Oscar Bay Ambition and Tokyo Getaway as they come down to the final flight. Lil Smith with Wealth set up on the near side challenging. And it's Wealth set up on the near side getting level with Lil Smith there out in front of Bay Ambition. And racing inside the last 150 yards, it's Wealth set up and Ricky Doyle stretching on as they run to the finish. Markedly down in grade and distance justifies odds on favoritism by a couple of lengths. Wealth set up beat Lil Smith, Bay Ambition and Broomfield's Oscar. Dropping away on the far side is King Christoph as they come to the final flight and ABC and Nile Madden with black, yellow, red and David Mullins. These two emerge away now from Kansas Kid and it's ABC the leader from black, yellow, red. Kansas Kid theatre run, Fly de Magode racing into the closing stages and it's ABC and Nile Madden with the riderless horse for company and at the finish, ABC, one of the joint top weights, wins well the service matters handicap for the Maddens. Second is Black, Yellow, Red, then Kansas Kid Theatre Run, Fly to Magode. Dropping away on the far side is King Christoph as they come to the final flight and ABC and Nile Madden with Black, Yellow, Red and David Mullins. These two emerge away now from Kansas Kid and it's ABC the leader from Black, Yellow, Red, Kansas Kid Theatre Run, Fly to Magode racing into the closing stages and it's ABC and Nile Madden with the riderless horse for company and at the finish ABC, one of the joint top weights wins well the service match Matters handicap for the Maddens. Second is Black, Yellow, Red, then Kansas Kid Theatre Run, Fly to Magode. Drawn a long way clear from Da Vinci Rock, Blazer Trail. Racing for the final flight in the Ross Commandant Course Vets Maiden Hurdle. Shan Walla, Liam Gilligan, pressed by the big galloper and Kevin Broder in between horses on the outside. Mountain Moore and Paul Townend. Now they race uphill and saw the final 200 yards. The big galloper in between horses. Shan Walla, the far rail on the near side is Mountain Moore. It's the big galloper from Shan Walla and Mountain Moore. And the big galloper in between horses with Shan Walla. The angle does favour the near side here. Drawn a long way clear from Da Vinci Rock, Blazer Trail. Racing for the final flight in the Ross Commandant Course Vets Maiden Hurdle. Shan Walla, Liam Gilligan, pressed by the big galloper and Kevin Broder in between horses on the outside. Mountain Moore and Paul Townend. Now they race uphill and saw the final 200 yards. The big galloper in between horses. Shan Walla, the far rail on the near side is Mountain Moore. It's the big galloper from Shan Walla and Mountain Moore. And the big galloper in between horses with Shan Walla. The angle does favour the near side here and then Mountain Moore in third with a break back to Randall's your pole. As 
Coming under pressure is Dura Ward and Rachel Blackmore. Grey Waters is still staying on for JJ Slevin over the final fence. It's Jenga, the leader from Dura Ward, and parting company with her rider, Grey Waters. And it's Jingle in the lead from Dura Ward. And Jingle will repeat wins over fences for Adrian Heskin, John Quayley, as. Coming under pressure is Dura Ward and Rachel Blackmore. Grey Waters is still staying on for JJ Slevin over the final fence. It's Jenga, the leader from Dura Ward, and parting company with her rider, Grey Waters. And it's Jingle in the lead from Dura Ward. And Jingle will repeat wins over fences for Adrian Heskin, John Quayley, and the McNeil family has made all in the Ballymore Irish EBF novice from Dura Ward. Back in third is Cliff House. Dawn Raider can't find any more and it's Court Tycoon in front between the final two fences from Russian Bill Spansel Hill and then comes Belgrove Deputies Pass and Dawn Raider at the final fence it's Court Tycoon from Russian Bill on the near side it's these two into the closing stages of the Irish EBF handicap chase Court Tycoon and Russian Bell on the near side precious little between them Russian Bell on the near side of Court Tycoon Court Tycoon Russian Bell Dawn Raider can't find any more, and it's Court Tycoon in front between the final two fences from Russian Bill Spansel Hill. And then comes Belgrove Deputies Pass and Dawn Raider at the final fence. It's Court Tycoon from Russian Bill on the near side. It's these two. Enter the closing stages of the Irish EBF handicap chase, Court Tycoon and Russian Bell on the near side. Precious little between them. Russian Bell on the near side of Court Tycoon. Court Tycoon, Russian Bill. That's certainly gone to the judge with Belgrove third and fourth with Spansel Hill. It's closer than you think. And it is Swordsman on the far side who will lead at the last from Templemore Dream, then Flawless Escape, Mount Hanover, out of the loop, Paranoid, and Cherokee Bill running up to the finish, and it's Swordsman. And Jack Kennedy leading home a Gordon Elliott 1-2. Here is Flawless Escape, fills the second, and then Templemore Dream, Mount Hanover, and Paranoid next. And it is Swordsman on the far side who will lead at the last from Templemore Dream, then Flawless Escape, Mount Hanover, out of the loop, Paranoid and Cherokee Bill running up to the finish and it's Swordsman and Jack Kennedy leading home a Gordon Elliott 1-2 here is Flawless Escape fills the second and then Templemore Dream Mount Hanover and Paranoid next. Patrick Mullins, the first to go for his mount, as Wavelength and Barry O'Neill over on the far side of Lutrec. And these two have it between them, drawn on from part-time affair. Wavelength on the far side of Lutrec. As they run up towards the finish, Wavelength on the far side of Lutrec. Wavelength just forges ahead at the death. Patrick Mullins, the first to go for his mount, as Wavelength and Barry O'Neill over on the far side of Lutrec. And these two have it between them, drawn on from part-time affair. Wavelength on the far side of Lutrec. As they run up towards the finish, Wavelength on the far side of Lutrec. Wavelength just forges ahead at the death from Lutrec, who gave everything, 